Make me a little bit of, uh, maybe we need to strangle some, some tra tragic people here. Right? That's something that we should all agree upon doing, I think, a little more often in our, in our lives. It's, it's just strangling, you know? Um, like, if you're, if you're mad at someone, how is it that you want to take them out? Right? And I think the art of just the good old classic, you know, just Scranton Strangler, you know, you get them around the neck, you squeeze hard, um, you watch the light drain from their eyes as the oxygen is unable to enter their lungs, to the trachea, and I think that's, I think there's a lost art to that. That we should be um, devoting more of our time to. Does that, do I think you should go out and strangle someone? Of course not. Would it be kind of funny? No. Would it be funny if you did it because I'm talking about it? That would be funny, actually. That would be really funny. It wouldn't. It would not be funny. <laughs> okay. Um, triangulation will now begin. <laughs> triangulation strangulation. Did you have coffee? I did have coffee. Uh, in the form of um, Coca-Cola from Burger King. I had... Hold on here. Let me make sure my audio uh, is is good. Okay. We're, we are good. Ah! Okay, we're good. I gotta do the screen test. Because that's the only professional method I have. Um, so I listened to a podcast the other day uh, that was talking about, like, um, essentially just, like, the environment, right? And it kind of opened my eyes to some of the simple things you can do. Not that I go out and get Burger King all the time. The last time I got Burger King, aside from like today, was... Whoa, that was before this new apartment, actually. Before we moved. It was like the last time I got Burger King. Otherwise, I've, I just haven't gotten Burger King. I haven't. Um, and it was 12 bucks. It was not worth it, but I got an Impossible Burger because I was so intrigued at people talking about like, oh yeah, the alternatives out there, they basically smell, smell, <laughs> they smell the same, they taste the same. And I gotta say, if you came up to me and you're just like, have this burger, and I ate the burger, and I was like, mmm, that was good. What was that, Burger King? They're like, yeah, it was the Impossible Whopper. I'd have been like, what? That's delicious. And then I would have continued to not go to Burger King because it's still way too expensive for not that good of food. Oh, yeah, I got the Impossible Whopper. But still... I am now a true believer in the alternative, like, less carbon footprint, better for the environment alternative foods out there because of that little experience I had. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with trying it. Does that mean I'm going to not buy thick cut bacon to have uh, in my mornings and I'm going to go to, like, fake bacon when they make it? Maybe. Actually, yeah. Does that mean I'm going to stop eating bacon until then? <gasps> no! All right, uh, continuing the game. Your quick save data will be erased. I never did that, so shut up with your stupid face hole. Game. What do you know? What do you know? Chat, what do you know? Tell me a fact right now. Someone in chat right now, give me a fact. Tell me a fact that you know. Do it. Tell me a fact. Okay, um, I'm gonna turn the volume up a little bit so that I may be able to um, see and smell things. Last time on Triangle Strategy, we did a one battle and then listened and read over three hours of dialogue. Pancakes are delicious. Dang straight.
and this time we're actually going to get into another battle. Of which, it's not just me. It's not just me. Other people are having the same issue of like, when does the game give me another fight? And as I watch other people play this game, play just the beginning, not up to, you know, I stop at this point when I'm watching these people. Um, they have the same reactions of, so is this the battle? No. Okay, here's the here's the special one. Here's the green, you know, the, the side quest thing. Oh, that was just, just lore. Okay. Oh, oh, here we go. Here's, here's a, oh, we're walking around town. Okay. Oh, uh, cho choices. Okay. Oh, that was the end of the chapter. Oh, oh, new chapter. Okay, here comes the battle. No, no battle. Okay, um, all right, next part. Here we go. Still no, no battle. Okay, all right. He's drunk and he's asleep now. Cool. Oh, next day. Here we go. Here comes the battle. Oh, walking around again, talking to people. Okay. Oh, a choice. Oh, no battle. Okay. Um. Oh, here's the battle. Way too long. Took way too long. And every time I watch people and I'm, I'm looking through, like, where they... I'm just... I'm seeing places they could have had a mini scuffle. Just like, on the way, they ran into more bandits. Blah, 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 blah. Like, just give me something to do. You're giving me all these characters to play as. Let me use them. You give me someone in my party. Now, please, tell me. Please. Don't just tell me how they work. Let me try to make it work. And they didn't do that. But hopefully they do now. So, here we go. Entering the world of um, Mortal Kombat. Oh, my time off requests uh, for Walmart got approved. The combatants have arrived, and the stage has been set. Let us introduce the champions who will fight for the glory of their nation. The glory! Oh, let me put it on auto, so that way we're just continually moving forward. So, here's what I've decided is going to happen. I'm just going to let these parts play out, and I'm going to try to save any and all comments for after the the thing has Fighting happened. for the honor of the Grand Duchy of Esfrost, General Avlora. Fighting for the honor of the Holy State of Hyzant, Minister Exham Marshall. Fighting for the honor of the Kingdom of Glenbrook, House Wolfort. Ra -ra. And last but not least, the victor of our previous tourney, Sir Maxwell the Donspear. Mm. Hi, Dad. Hurrah! The Wolfhort Lordling is here in his father's stead, I see. Do you like my nails? Lord Simon's heroics on the battlefield are the stuff of legend. A pity I couldn't match swords with him today. You will match swords with me. I promise to make it every bit as exhilarating as father would. You have his spirit, if nothing else. Indeed. I look forward to crossing swords. Please say crossing swords one more time. Just the try to wait a fit in assembled. there without actually letting us cross swords. Now. Let the battles begin! I shall announce our first pairing as chosen by Lot. We're drawing Lot? Minister Exham wow. and Lord this is so biblical. Make ready for combat! What does high back mean? My name isn't back. Oh, we're literally just going to fight. Here. This is like close quarters. I played a game before. I know what, how to do it. Okay. Unit placement. I know what it does. It's not that hard. Let me look at you. Can I do a thing? I want to look at your face. Give me your face. I want to see your beautiful face. Can I not look at the roster for the enemies? No. Whoop. There we go. <coughs> okay, we've got um S Sorsley, who is definitely um Pretty cool. 
you got a peacock dagger. <laughs> He's able to... <laughs> he can watch The Office with his peacock dagger. Um, slumber Stab, so he's going to try to sleep us. Also, I, I absolutely hate, you want to know what I hate? What makes me scared? I like, there we go. Reading that resist instant death is a thing, because that means instant death is something that could happen to me. <laughs> um, which brings me to my next point. I learned that there is no um, permadeath in this game. When a unit dies, or when a unit falls in battle, they're not dead. They're just out of the game. They're out of the, um, that, like, skirmish, right? But they'll come back. Which allows for, well, instant death. Which is kind of neat. Kind of neat. Adds a new dynamic. Um, so this guy's just immune to some, some bullcrap, which is not the best, but whatever. No accessories on either of these two dudes. Um, he looks bored out of his mind. Get this man something else to do. He's got delaying thrust. <gasps> throwing knife? What's the range on throwing knife? One to two? That's not that much range. That's not really much to figure out. Okay. Nothing too crazy going on. Passive increases damage inflicted to you by spears. Wow, I don't like that. Um, okay. How many, what people do I have? Do I have everyone? Oh shoot, I have everyone with me, right? Um, yeah. Mm, nice. Times deployed, <laughs> really? That's kind of an interesting stat. That way you can just go to your your favorite units and just times deployed. What are my highest units? We're using those. Movement. Okay. Well, here's what we're going to do, obviously. Um, obviously, we're going to have Shield Man in front. And he's going to lead the fray. And then Little Miss Piggy on her horse of wind and feathers is going to be over there. Um, what's the turn order? We're going, uh, we're going last. Is that Hewitt? No, that's Anna. Um, who's going second? Who is that? Okay, that is Anna. Um, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You're definitely staying back here. You... We're gonna put you kind of in front here. Even though you have high mobility, this is close quarters, so mobility really doesn't matter in the slightest. Um, sure. That guy's blue 11 sword up there. What a weirdo. Okay, we're good. We're good. We shall begin the battle. Wind is breezy, remember that. The wind is breezy and the weather is clear. Because apparently the wind and the weather matter in this game. Oh, I can't wait to do this fight. And then I can't wait to wait until the next one. That's just how I'm feeling right now about this game. The battle begins. Can I go? Be gentle, my lords. I'm not as strapping as once I was. For you. I expect no quarter from you, Prince Roland, nor from you, Lord Serenoa. Show us the sword play your house is so famous for. How about the shield play? Eat your dinner. Or two of Hyzant's most famed generals will have no room for mistakes. Then we shall make none. Now, let us show the realm the medal of the new generation. The new generation. 
fight for the for future. Honor and glory. Street Fighter 3. Oh. Time to work. Okay. And then Dookie Knight up here is going next. No, it's you, Dookie Knight. Um. Tyzantian Pike. Hello, my name is Mr. Pike. Where? Um. So you don't have your ability that allows you to. Uh. Oh, you do have act twice. Good. But you don't have your like take cover and summer surmount. So then act twice kind of doesn't matter a whole lot. Um, you're also fairly squishy. Well, actually, you don't have too bad of defense. See, you're like a spy, though. I would have assumed you're like this squishy, fast, critical hit. Um, critical hit woman. You're fast, and you have accuracy. Who's the luckiest of the bunch? Not really anyone. Everyone's kind of just a basic, basic person right now. So we're kind of just fighting to fight. Um, so we've got uh, this guy going next, and he can really he can really move it, move it. Uh, so what we're gonna do, as any good um, strategic strategery uh, would have you commence. In. We're just gonna move you up one uh, small uh, step. For victory. Okay. Uh, yes. Yes, quite. Um, you stay there. The word weak. Weak will appear over enemy units are susceptible to it, while resistant will appear for those who are not. Gain the upper hand in battle by exploiting enemy weakness. Oh, because he's he literally has a passive ability that makes him suck at not dying to spears. That's really interesting. That they don't they didn't go for like a weapon triangle or anything like anything like that. It's just like a passive ability. Which is, I can get behind, actually. We're just gonna keep everyone where they are until I can move, um, Shield Bro up. Oh, he's come to play. Here You're I getting come. in formation. Oh, no. Sarah knows gonna be next. And then other Dookie Knight gets to move. Yeah, let's move, uh, Hewitt kind of, uh... You're in the range of Dookie Knight. Oh, you're really in the range of Dookie Knight. Ah, no longer in the range of Dookie Knight. I don't know why I'm calling him Dookie Knight. I just am. What's your ra Oh, your range is not as I expected. Not as I expected. Um... That's not a ton of damage. A chance to blind them for three turns. Uh, let's just go after the boss. Oh, excuse me. We've yeah. gained 17 experience. And where shall we strike? Okay. So I know he's gonna do something. What that is, I'm not too sure. If I do this, you're 14. If I do this, then oh, Dookie Knight could get around. 
See, I'm not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of Dookie Knight doing some doing some major stuff, you know. Dookie Knight can get around there too. Yeah, see, I'm I don't I'm not a fan of Dookie Knight doing doing that kind of stuff, you know? I do not want Dookie Knight uh, getting involved. So we're gonna move Saranoa right there. That hits like that. I see a path uh, I don't to not appreciate that. Okay. Um, Benedict, give the raging beast to your boy. It is time to spare you no more. We'll get Raise a thy shield. And now defend I'll take your you honor on. by putting yourself <laughs> um, provoke. Yes, beat him in the face. Thank you. And then just face him off. There we go. All right, now some stuff is happening. Maybe next Missed. time. Yo. Now then. Let me heal your. Wounds. Let me heal your wounds. You're gonna stay right back here. Uh, yes. And now, I think would be a good time to uh, launch into a bit of a scorch, yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, you're out of range, technically. Oh, but you will get hit there. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Actually, hmm, who's moving next? It's you. Um, he's definitely gonna do some major deeps too. I almost called him Eduardo, Ariador, Ariador. So let's take. Um, let's just continue with the turn. Yeah, let's just do. Continue with the plan. Um, that's not that much more damage, so we're just gonna hit all three. Right there. Please heed my call. That was good. That was really good. Kudos! Certain maneuvers will award you kudos, which can be traded for valuable items. Okay. So make cool plays, and you get rewarded. Close. Oh, you life. suck! Okay. You're so bad at being good at your job. You should be fired. Um. Okay. Anna. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have you come over here. That's all you can do, is you can just strike. And that's fine. Yes. Attack. And attack again. Never mind, you can move twice. I forgot that you're awesome. How I forgot that? Uh, let's see here. Ooh, this would be kind of neat. Doing like, um... Can I get behind you? I can't. Oh, I should have moved you up a little more. Oh, well. Uh... Oh, we can hit both of these guys. Who's next? You're next. You have sustained no damage, though, is the thing. Are you weak to anything in particular? You have Knight's Bane. Um, who's got the, who's got the, who's got that, that thruster? You've got the thruster. So, um, Dookie, Dookie Knight on the right could do some deeps to, to your boy. And I don't, not particularly a fan about that. But we might have to just do what we have to do. Uh, just play it safe. For now. Yeah, play it safe. Yeah, you fruit. Did you see that? Ooh, also then this way. Um 
Eridor can't be double struck, uh, like, twice. <gasps> you kooky dooky pooky looky fluky dooky. Why are you- My is yours. This was destined to occur. Interesting. So I should have turned him. I see your every There's no joy in an easy victory. Wow. I shall do what I can. Okay. I have acquired understanding untold. Untold understanding. Cure wounds. Your wounds are here. Sorry to worry. There we go. My growth is Hey, paid. level up. Let's go. All right, Dookie Knight. Oh, no, that's not Dookie Knight yet. Uh, we want to... Hmm. I just gotta think a couple moves ahead of... It's you two. Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. That way we can set up someone to get the drop on him. Raging Beast. Rolling. It is time to strike. Splendid. See, I'm going to get real, real reckless um, with this game because I know now that characters don't just, like, insta-die. Oh, my. I forgot about Hewitt. She's very weak. I've been waiting for this. Look. We can look everywhere. Oh, <laughs> who's next? Yeah, we're doing for those. Oh, is it only one? All enemies within range. Yeah. Provoke. Do it. Come and get me. Oh! Oh shoot! It worked. <laughs> Set of changes are denoted with an icon. That's beautiful. Poison! Oh, this is gonna be important. Poison deals damage at the start of each turn. Paralysis prevents the unit from taking any actions. Ew. Silence prevents unit from using abilities, which makes sense. Sleep prevents unit from taking any actions. Actions on sleeping units will be critical hits. <gasps> unit wakes up upon taking damage. Immobility, you can't move. Blindness, your accuracy sucks. Fury draws targets attacks to the caster, which is what I've just done. Tempt. Lures target to their opponent's side? Really? Interesting. Instant death kills unit instantly. Oh, auto revive! Automatically revives a unit when the HP reaches zero. Regen uh, grants HP at the start of each round, which is, sounds great. Invincible. Uh, unit ignores all damage. Take cover. Renders unit invisible, which is fantastic, and Anna will get that at some point. Fire counter. Deals fire damage to an adjacent enemy using a physical attack, and then ice counter is basically the same. Deals ice damage to an attacking enemy. Oh, just to an attacking enemy. Oh gosh, act again. We already know what that does. Stop. Prevents unit from taking any actions. Effects wear off over time. Protect. Allows caster to take damage for a selected unit. Cool. Guaranteed critical. Unit critical. <laughs> Absorption converts a specific element's damage to HP. Cool. Um, delayed damage deals damage after a set number of turns. So kill Bill. Extended range. <laughs> Extended warranty. Extends the warranty of a unit's normal attack. Protective aura. Reduces damage taken by adjacent allies. I like that. Okay, Sarah Noah. You need to do um, something good like this. Uh, delaying strike on this guy because he's very rude. I struck through. 
Just as I planned. <laughs> Allow me. Uh, I just no. I just want to know your eight. We have quite a few things to do before uh, you do anything. Which is good. What's the most I can do damage-wise for for this situation? Eh. Eh. really got to think here. So this guy's going to go next. And then it's Anna. And then it's Roland. But these guys are infuriated. This dude isn't. So Anna is actually going to come over here. Um, short bow. Kill this dude. That's a hundred percent accuracy too, right? That, that's that's what that means. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Goodbye. Yeah. This battle is won. May I? Oh, that count as a critical hit because technically behind him. Okay. I like that. We'll want to face you this way. I will end this. Sure. Uh, we can do... Your five. Ooh. Mm. Oh, you're not gonna get the back strike? What? I think second turn I could still kill him though. I could still kill him. But he's enraged. And I'm more concerned about saving Hewitt. <laughs> um Of course he's got the spear, so he could do some damage. Eh, ooh. This is risky. This is some risky business here. Uh that we won't be able to kill him. We won't be able to kill him. So Hewitt's probably going down, uh, which is fine. So what we're going to do, even though I could just use an HP recovery item, I should. I really should. Uh, murder. Death. And destruction. Also, I like this character. This I want to level up, so she needs to get some stabs in. Okay. Um. Sure. My turn. You undoubtedly, you're gonna attack our 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 lady. So we're gonna we're gonna put a stop to that. And then everyone else is enraged, but um, Spearface. So, yeah. Brace yourself! God, excuse me! Take it. Take it, dude. Take it. You've got this. We believe in you. Shall we begin? Oh, yeah, that's bad. Ah, you for the Ooh, this was ah yeah. Well, that's okay. That's fine. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Oh man, yeah, that hurts. Mm, that's definitely not gonna be good. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Cool heads mm. shall prevail. <laughs> what a boss! He took it like a champion. And now I'm gonna heal him. And next turn he's gonna do it all over again. Oh, yay. <laughs>
Um, yeah. Heal that guy up. I know I was gonna heal Hewitt, but he's putting in too much work right now to get a tank. Oh, what a masterful boy. Oh, I love him. Oh, we get to beat the crap out of someone now. Who? <laughs> Um, we have one more turn of rage and fury. Uh, let's go for, uh, oh, I can do provoke again, should I? I don't think I need to do provoke again. We can kill this guy? I don't want to do that, because I want fire. Right? Fire will do some major, like 22, right? And if I hit this guy, he'll be left with 22. So fire would end him. End his pathetic struggle, Yugi. Uh, and that's great. So we're gonna go ahead and just attack... Spearman, I guess. Come on! 31. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Um... Wait, what? Am I attacking again? No, I'm just choosing which way I'm facing, right? Yeah. And... I... think we're gonna want to face this way. Defeat is not an option. Oh my gosh. Is, is this my whole party is now next? This is great. This is perfect. Benedict died, but that's okay. Um, I hope. Uh, we'll see. Yeah, Sarah Noah is gonna go ahead, um, swing around, oh shoot, because I, I feel like, yeah, Sarah Noah, you're gonna come over here, you're gonna put in some work on, um, Potato Head, Mr. Potato Head over here, do we need to delay him strike? Oh, that, does that even delay him? If I were to delaying strike, he would go to 16. Okay. That's worthwhile. I think that's super worthwhile. We're doing that. Gonna get that critical hit. Wait your turn. My wife's gonna beat him in the face of the book. May I? Whoa! He can dodge extra moves. I don't like it. But I understand. Okay. Um, uh, you need to heal, actually. Is the, is the issue. Um, I put you here. Oh, well, you're definitely in horse range, right? Let's just keep you, like, this way. Uh, yeah, let's do that, actually. Whoa, bop. Yes. Let me show you what I've learned. Let me show you why I'm hot. That's what I thought I heard. Um... If we could just, like, box this guy in, that would be kind of neat. I don't have enough for Scorch. Oh, no. <gasps> I've made a grave, grave error. Well, maybe not terrible. Probably not horrible. Um, that's what we can do. Ooh. Yeah, not great. I kind of forgot about that. Okay, this is fine. Everything's okay. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be great. Things. Are, it's gonna be great. Um, that's a lot of damage to you. sucks.
Yeah, we're gonna have to do it this way. This is, I think, a good move. Here I come. Oh, so you left yourself open. I hate that I forgot about um, not having enough I will points to this. use. You know, it really is not good. And I forgot about that. Okay, we get Iron Dagger you once, twice. Oh, we should probably try to kill. We won't though. Hmm. Now let's do it. This will prove useful. I enjoy that. For victory! Like, immensely. So... What we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put you under Imperial Arrest. We gotta take out one of these guys. We have to. We literally have to. Okay, we can double thrust this guy. Actually, we can regular thrust this guy. And he will die. Okay, that's good. Because that'll eliminate at least one attack on um, on our, our tank here, on Eridor. Eridor? Cool. Excellent. Okay. He's got the Fury. No double hit. Fury is up. Nice try. Sick. Oh, he dodged it. Yes. That's bad. Oh, he just used sandstorm. Oh my gosh. Kind of did not realize I just put her between two bosses. I think that is why there is no permadeath in this game, because it's gonna be kind of hard, and I like that. More experience for her. Okay, but now we have my whole team, basically, um, up next, which is good. He's still infuriated. Huh. Okay, I really gotta think about this. Oh man, you could just finish off the rogue. Oof. Ooh. Mm. Is this possible? Yeah, we're just gonna kite shield. Guard. Take a moment. We win. Look at me learning. That's incredibly tempting. I really want that. You fight admirably, but you will not claim victory so easily. I mean, I think I'm about to. The numbers are few, but they are fierce. Stay focused and drive them back. Let me heal your wounds. Stop here. Get the thing. Greedy. Um. Yes. Face that way. And where shall we strike? Uh. Let me think. Let me think. Delay him again. So we'll put you there. Then who's next? It's Anna. Oh yeah, we want to delay him for sure, for sure. 
Yeah. Wait your turn. Have another. Okay. I won't get now. Might take the chance to blind. I think that's our that's our best play. From this range. Together. Oh, he resists blindness. I forgot about that. Oh well. My turn. That's okay. So let's see. You got one. Oh, your movement. Perfect. That's that's what I needed to know. Okay, so we're gonna move you definitely in harm's way here. Um 25% chance of poison. more damage. Yep. Hold on. Is that oh, it has range. Oh. But I want the crit. That's the thing, right? I want the critical hit. So let's just go max damage and just see if that's something that's an even good strategic. Well, uh, uh, uh. Eridor's getting hit by Spear, by our, um, our boss there. And Spear Guy, who knows? It's possible Gila dies this turn as well. But we're feeling out the game. I need I need more battles. I need these battles. Goddess, I thank you for your blessing this day. A worthy foe is a glorious gift indeed. You find the goddess in odd places, Exam. This trifling tourney will bring Heizant neither riches nor glory. The goddess works in myriad ways, Minister Sorsley. You would do well to keep your eyes attuned. He says as he's just like enraged at the shield bearer. I won't lose. I would appreciate if you f if you focused. You never know when something bad could happen. No, oh gosh! Yes, you're open. Goodbye. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I asked for no quarter. You did not disappoint. Perhaps one day. Awesome. That went exactly how I was hoping. That that extra damage I did, going max damage with Anna, Minister paid off. I leave the rest to your capable hands. That's awesome. Exquisite spoiler to the moon. Alright, do your worst, you furious freak. Four. This can't be! I've been waiting for this! Awesome. Okay, let's just start one by one taking these fools out. Uh, we'll put you behind him. Oh! We'll just kill you. How about that? Time to shine! Shall we begin? Harry Door is a true bro. Pure wounds. Your wounds are Get the heals going. I appreciate it. Wonderful, wonderful. For the honor of House Wolfort. Okay. Yeah, why wouldn't we delay any strike? We're so close to the end. Let's Wait just your push turn. him back farther. <laughs> Take his turns. Uh -huh. The hunt is on. Uh land here. Might as well blinding arrow. Darkness engulfs you. Oh. You've left yourself <gasps> open. Ha <laughs> ha! My skills grow sharper. Ooh. 
Sweet. Time to work. And Anna's gonna get the final hit. Perfect. Let's try, uh, let's see what poison throw looks like. Because the animation in this game are very cool. Suffer. Ah. Oh, we got the poison. Hello, <laughs> Pursuit stance. Does that do extra My damage on a, like, a back attack I can fight no uh, bonus action? <sighs> I want more battles. <laughs> that was fun. That was really fun. I'm worried. I'm worried I'm gonna have to go pop a bag of popcorn for another three hour, like, interlude. God, it's just really upset about that. Cool. You know, I like no permadeath. I think Fire Emblem has having permadeath, you know, as like the gimmick of, oh, I love these HP. I love these characters and all that. That's that's neat. That's a neat gimmick. But just being able to just make a game that's no holds barred. Um, like, we're not pulling our punches. We're making this game intense. We're making the strategy super, like, dense. And um, you will be stuck in fights because you can't win. Not because you're trying to minimize. You're trying to win while minimizing losses. Just because you're trying to win because it's difficult. I like that. I think that maybe a little more. We'll see. We'll see how it progresses. After all, it is a different game. Different uh, game, different series. Not even series. This is just kind of a... The art style is the series. But then again, they're making... They they're remaking or remade Live Alive and the HD Duty. Which I really want to check out. Because I just like these games. They look cool. They're great ways to revive old franchises. You know, old SNES franchises and whatnot. And look, everyone's alive. We're good. We're good. Yeah, there's no permadeath in this game. It never told me there was permadeath, so... Wonderful. Your father taught you well. You wield that great sword with skill beyond your years. Well fought. The day is yours. Victory goes to House Wolford! Our next bout shall be between General Ablora and Sir Maxwell. May glory go to the victor. We're gonna get a little, uh, what, battle scene? Stand back. This one is mine. Okay, getting a little personal. <laughs> Very well. I accept your challenge. Oh, just one on one, huh? Ooh, that was the blank strike. You see that? Whoever taught you, they taught you well. Though something tells me you surpassed your teacher long ago. Your defense is formidable. As is yours. Oh. I yield. Victory goes to Sir Maxwell. I don't like that he was surprised by that. My hand. I can't feel it. Oh. So that was General of Laura. I pray never to meet her on the battlefield. What did she do to his hand? The Wushu finger hold? On his hand? No, that makes you explode. Never mind. Oh, we can get right no into this? Order given today, young lord of House Woolfort. I would expect nothing less. <gasps> More battles. Or not. Saranoa loses. <laughs> huh? Where am I? You were knocked out cold and we dragged your <sighs> lifeless body away. <laughs> ah, you're awake. <laughs> ah, you're awake. And none the worse for wear, considering the blow you took from Sir Maxwell. Uh, he was too strong for us in the end. Today, yes. 
But let us keep at our training. One day, the students will surpass their master. Let us work hard for that day, my friend. Oh, there you go. Save your game? Yes, please. I'm going to turn the heat down um, uh, really quick because it is way too hot in here right now. I'm also tempted to bring out the animal crackers. Oh, I've got blackberries. Clearly, I'm not decided. We're gonna wait. I'll drink my water, but we're gonna wait. And so. Sarah Noah and his stalwart allies prove their mettle against the realm's fiercest warriors before finally facing Sir Maxwell, victor of the previous tourney. After a hard fought match, the Dawn Spear emerges victorious once more. Though beaten in the end, Sarah Noah's courageous display impresses itself upon all in attendance. Any doubts concerning House Wolfort's martial might are put to rest. Thus marks an end to the tourney and the festivities as a whole. With the spirit of harmony in their hearts, the delegates of each nation make preparations for their return voyages. That means there's gonna be like battles, right? <laughs> oh, is this the demo? Are we at the demo now? Have we reached the demo? Seeing our honored guests off shall be your last lordly duty this day. Now, I remind you. It is not to be taken lightly. Worry not, Benedict shall be sent off with all the pomp they deserve. You take to your new role well, Lord Serenoa. As I must now take to my own. Pray, visit me at the mines whenever you have the time. Oh boy. Farewell, Frederica. May we never meet again. Thank you for such a productive use of our valuable time. I do so love interminable speeches and watching brutes play at war. Truly, the spirit of Glenbrook was on display for all to see. Why do you guys gotta be like that? You're clearly evil. Oh, but I should watch my tongue. Wouldn't want her to go whimpering to brother. Hey, my fool cousin, no mind. We have work to do. Work more important than any he could hope to be trusted with. I apologize for those two. This was a fruitful day for all in attendance. I am glad to hear you say so, General of Laura. I can't believe we lost. I thought you were supposed to be one of Hyzep's greatest warriors. Our foe was a worthy one. It would be an honor to cross blades again someday. Thank you for your hospitality. Please give my regards to Lord Simone. Simone. Of course, Minister. Very important that we pronounce his name correctly. It would seem everyone is gathered. You'll find your boats are laden with a bounty of Glenbrook's finest wares and victuals. King Regna asks that you eat and drink your fill and toast to our three nations' newfound alliance. More of that swill you call wine? I suppose I could force myself to partake. Your king honors us with his generosity. We shall present these as offerings to the goddess of salt. 
the Hierophant too. Will no doubt be Who's the Hierophant? Why do you keep saying things like I know what I'm getting myself into? Lord Wolford, I bring a message from King Regna. He would have you join our guests on their return voyage to serve as their envoy. Oh. This is a great honor, my lord. You would represent our nation and speak with the king's voice. If it is his majesty's wish, it is a duty I will gladly accept. But there are two vessels and only one of me. Did King Regna say which of our honored guests I should accompany? He would leave that decision to you, Lord Wilford. Oh. Lord Falks, as representative of another of Glenbrook's high houses, will board the ship you do not. And why was House Tellior not given this honor? Last I knew, our kingdom had three high houses, not two. The mere fact that you whimper those words before us is <laughs> answer enough. Because you're... oh. <sighs> wow. So little holding of the controller, Good show at the and so Lord little Sarah things I'm doing, that the Fox switch was like, oh, the he's not playing the video game this anymore. Decision in your hands, and I shall not gainsay his wisdom. A lord must be worldly as well as wise. I trust you will conduct yourself as befits the lord of a high house. Thank you, Sir Maxwell, Lord Falks. The king has entrusted this decision to you, my lord. I suppose you have an idea as to why. He means to test my judgment. He is waiting to see which I choose and for what reason. Indeed. We are friendly with both nations now, so neither choice will earn his ire. That said, there is no telling how these relations may change going forward. No doubt, the choice you make will have an effect on our own house's relationship with the nation you choose. I understand. This requires careful consideration. Benedict, gather the others. I would hear their opinions on the matter. Then we shall consult the scales of conviction. At once, my lord. Are you serious? Quick, get my friends near me. I need help deciding which boat to get on. Even though Benedict literally just said, it won't really matter, except it could. What? Ooh, the Sandry shop. I do want to go there. Oh, now we have a scale action. Any, like, side stuff? No. Can I zoom out anymore? So, oh. who's the first one? You must be the Sondry man. Yes, give me the kudos. At the Sondry shop, you can exchange kudos and items. Promote your allies. Ooh. Mm. Trade posts. Yes. Uh, quiet uses? Quiet quit uses? Are commands executed immediately in battle and differ from abilities in three key ways. They do not consume a turn. They consume two points. <laughs> not uh, each quietus may only be used once per battle. So you just start with a thing just on on beginning of, of the battle, which is neat. Okay. I will never read these, so I'm not gonna get them. And I don't have enough for this anyway. Ooh.
my opponents get to do these things too? That's so frightening. Who do I promote? To... Yes. Promoting a unit will increase their stats and maximum TP. Their toilet paper. Needs more toilet paper. And a lot of new acquirable abilities. Uh, their appearance, no. Because sprite art. If they are not at, if they are at or above the specified level, yes, makes sense. Okay, so we need to be level ten. We all need to be level ten. So no one's gonna promote right now. But we would go from swordsman, recruit swordsman to veteran. So level two is veteran, and then that would be sword fighter, which is neat. Um, can I see what's after that? No. No. Medal of Bravery. Hmm. Well, she looks cool. See, I'm just way too into um, Anna and Eridor and how they work. So they're definitely the first ones I'm going to be going for. And then, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. I still learning the game and I wish I could get more battles in more often to... next it's you tavern you can engage in mental mock battles at the tavern each battle is different so choose the one that best suits your aims Do I get things for doing this? I get fiber for doing this. I get nothing for doing this. Let's... Hmm. See, here's the thing. You just did a battle. And if this is how they intend you to play the game in between your big lore dumps, is to come here and do a mock battle for rewards, that could work. I desperately want to do this one, but we have two right now. One's basic training, right? And that's really not going to be anything special. Cut your teeth in this small arena before moving on to more advanced trials. I don't want to cut anything, let alone my teeth. Let's get farther in the story. Let's just continue. Uh, yeah, let's just do it that way. I think that'll be good. Kinda have to. It seems your first test as Lord has come. Tis no small matter either. Indeed, but I needn't face it alone. I would ask each of you where you think we should go and why. State your case before the scales of conviction. Then we shall decide our destination. We take a vote and the consensus determines our action. Is that it? Why are you that here? That is correct. 
So long as my allies walk by my side, their opinions carry equal weight to mine. Such is the way of House Wolfport. As Lord, I shall bear the weight of consequence for the scale's decision, whatsoever they may be. You are more serious than usual, my friend. It's just a bow He ride. understands what it means to be Lord of his house. Well, I hope you have room for a stowaway, because I'm going to. In secret, of course. I trust the new Lord Wolfort will handle the ponderous negotiations and diplomacy with grace. Your Highness, you cannot be... You may stay ashore if you wish, Yue. You know I cannot allow that. If you insist on going, then I shall attend you. Well then, it would seem the matter is settled. There is exactly one coin for each of us. It seems fate has conspired to bring balance to our proceedings. How curious. Curious? I see it as a sign that the heavens approve of my joining you. You are ever the optimist, my friend. Shall we proceed, my lord? One coin, one vote. Very well. I would hear each of your thoughts on the matter in turn. Then you shall place your coin upon the scales of conviction and illuminate the road ahead. And this is something that happened in the... Yeah. And, oh yeah, here we go. So, this is something that was in the demo, for sure. That I was thinking, you know, that's a really cool mechanic. And I kind of thought... This was how they were going to do all of the exposition and lore dumps, was just within talking to people and making these decisions, right? Like, so, anyway, I might end here. I might end here, because this is kind of an important part, and I don't know. The game, the game is pretty slow. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But, um, I don't know. Like, I'm not not enjoying the game. It's just that it's really slow. And very dialogue heavy. And I just, I don't know why I don't remember, like, these games being so dialogue heavy. Maybe I'm just out of the out of the, uh, the tactical RPG world now, you know? Maybe I'm not, uh, maybe I'm not with it anymore. Maybe that's not my, my speed. But who knows, who knows? We'll, we'll try a couple more, I think, um, until, until Kirby comes out. Of course, I'm gonna play, I'm gonna definitely be playing Kirby when that comes out. Because that will be, ooh, that'll be a game. Because that is an action game, that is a game where you move around as a platformer, it is a Kirby game, it's a 3D, it's great. And, I don't know, we'll see. We shall see. No. Um. So if I just, like, quit out then, it'll go back to that save point, And I'll have to go through all the tutorial message boxes again? Maybe. Maybe. Can I go up the ladder? Oh, I can! Can I find a thing up here? I can find some frame drops. Can I go in this door? What's happening over here? Oh, wow. Everyone's here. Can I go out here and talk to someone else? What's going on? 
Oh my gosh. What have we done? I'm Ezio. This is Assassin's Creed. I'm running around, I'm jumping on stuff, and I'm... And I'm crazy. I can go down here. Hold on, let me look down here really... Whoa. Whoa. Really quick. No item. Okay, I think it's there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Is there a ladder on the other side? Probably. Yes. This has to be where the bazooka's at, right? Come on. No! No items? You're telling me they didn't put an item back here? Maybe you can't get items while you're doing this this part of the thing. I don't know. Anyway, uh, getting a little tired. Yeah, yeah, no, it's it's incredibly slow, actually. But yeah, the, the graphics, see, that's the thing, like, the graphics are incredible. I absolutely love, oh, the art style of this, of this game. You know, the HD2D stuff. But I don't know. I don't know. Lately... When I sit down and play a game, I want to be, I want to be able, it's kind of weird, right? When I play video games now, I like to listen to episodes of Seinfeld or listen to podcasts or whatever. Like, that's just kind of how I do it. Like, when I played Monster Hunter, when it came out on PC, again, not again, when it came out on PC, and it released again on PC, I was just grinding out the hunts. Um, listening to podcasts and episodes of Seinfeld, literally episodes of Seinfeld, and uh, it was great because I'm just like doing the action game stuff, listening to comedy, listening to information, you know. But it, with this, I can't be listening to Seinfeld and then reading like in depth what these characters are talking about. And for some reason, that is not appealing to me. It's weird. I think it's my, my, my brain is like, this isn't enough, I guess, productivity. Like, this isn't enough um, uh, engagement, I guess. I don't know. Might just be me. I might just need to play more and get the loop of the game down a bit. Um, but, yeah, it just seems really time-consuming. Like, it takes a lot of effort. A lot of focus to do one thing, and I felt that would just be the battles, and some dialogue options, and, and, you know, and these, which would, was great, but since there's so much else in between, I don't know. I just don't want to have to pay attention to all the exposition, and feel like I'm getting punished for not paying attention to the really, what I don't find very interesting. It's the, the lore in the world, which is, is fine. But, anyway, anyway, the, the good news is, though, the thing that I knew I'd like the most, which is the, the combat scenarios, um, fantastic. Incredible. Incredible. So I think next time we'll come back and we will do this, uh, little scales of whimsy. The whimsy of the scales of fate. What is it? The tr we'll do the triangulation. And, um, yeah. And then we'll uh, see what happens after that. Might be more story progression, and then we afterwards jump into one of those mock battles. That might be how we balance the game. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see moving forward if I want to finish this game or not. But. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. That's it. That's all. Have to say. Good night, so long, farewell, and do not do anything I wouldn't do. And please, I forgot to say this last time, I was just so tired. Please, do not forget to play some video games. Very important that we do. Signing out.